Hutchison in-die tapping heads enable you to change tap and tap height settings in the press in minutes. The HTS Model 3000 and 6000 series use our standard quick change pitch assembly. The HTS Model 3100 and 6100 series use the same quick change pitch assembly with an additional locking ring. To disengage the pitch assembly from the gearbox, loosen the locking ring on the pitch assembly. Push down on the pitch assembly and twist the assembly clockwise. The assembly will disengage from the gearbox. For the HTS Model 3000 and 6000 series, there's no locking ring to loosen, so just push down on the pitch assembly. Twist the assembly clockwise, and the assembly will disengage from the gearbox. Insert the slots of the lead screw into the keys on the tap extractor tool. The tap extractor has flats on it that allow it to be gripped in a vise, or you can use the knurled portion to hold the tool in your hand. Never insert the lead screw directly into a vise because this can damage the threads on the lead screw. Loosen the tap collet to remove the tap. Please note that the thread on the tap collet is a left-hand thread. Remove the worn tap. Insert a new tap into the collet, feeling for the square in the lead screw that matches the square drive on the tap. Insert the tap as far as it will go into the collet and tighten the collet. Before re-engaging the pitch assembly into the gearbox, the tap height must be set. Some companies will make a setting gauge in order to set the tap height, while others will just use a scale to confirm the correct tap height. The lead screw can be adjusted in the bushing to determine the correct height before it's re-engaged into the gearbox. The approximate tap height settings can be found on the sign-off sheets in the blue in-die tapping manual that comes with each unit. Some adjustments might have to be made to these initial starting positions. It's always better to initially err on the side of not tapping deeply enough versus tapping too deeply. Doing the latter could result in tap breakage. Please feel free to contact the factory with any tap height setting questions. Put the pitch assembly back into the gearbox by aligning the slots on the lead screw with the keys on the drive gear. Push the assembly down and twist counterclockwise until you feel the cartridge lock into place. Be sure to tighten the locking ring on the HTS Model 3100 and 6100 series. You're now ready to go into operation.